this shit here is hitting a little different. <clears throat> but you might see me coughing a little bit in this one. This, this hits a little harder. What's going on, y'all? It's your boy, Eddie Knight, and welcome back to the channel. If you've been here before, if not, what's going on? I'm a hip-hop artist and producer and self-proclaimed CBD connoisseur. I'm back with another review from another strain from 444 CBD LLC. They have had some really good stuff that I've liked so far. I'm trying another one of their strains. If you're watching this video and you're new to CBD products, you may not be a smoker and that is cool. I am not either, but I do smoke the CBD flower. But if, but if you wanna start using CBD and you don't want to take it in by smoking it, there's plenty of other ways to take it in. By capsules, vitamins, tinctures, you know, the oil that you put under your tongue, um, there's CBD water, all kind of crap like that. If you're interested in anything like that and not the actual smokables, then go ahead and go to the description of this video and there's a link to a company called American Shaman. They have all natural CBD products, no GMO, and it's gonna be full um, full spectrum CBD, meaning there's no THC whatsoever in any of the products. But anyways, back to the review, man. I hope y'all have been doing all right. It seems like y'all have been liking these CBD reviews because the views on them are going up and up. They're still low, but I expected that seeing how I just started doing them. Um, but anyways, man, I really like 444 CBD LLC. And uh, I got me a rolled up joint of the special sauce. And no, it did not come pre-rolled. I actually rolled it myself, um, but I didn't want to roll up in my car and drop bud everywhere. So I'm going to put a little video up here showing you the nug of this thing, showing you the consistency of it. Uh, the consistency is not bad. Um, it's, it's very it's sticky, not quite as sticky as that sour space candy that I had, but it's sticky. You know, it's a little bit drier than the Bubba Kush, a little bit drier than the sour space candy, but not bad at all. Not super dry and crusty and just break apart. It does have some stickiness to it. Um, pretty good looking flower. You can see the trichomes on it, so that's dope as well. And this special sauce is clocking in at 17.92 CBD percentage. Um, as far as the smell of this thing goes, man, uh, if you're a THC smoker, man, this is smells identical to some loud of just regular THC. This is probably the loudest as far as smell and potency goes of CBD that I've ever smelled. Like it smells like some gas. Like I know a lot of people out there stressed and don't know what to do. Um, and I understand that, man. You know, it, it's trying times out here. It's crazy out here. Um, so one, y'all be safe. Uh, and two, whether you're a CBD smoker or THC smoker, man, they say it affects your lungs more if you are a tobacco smoker. So please, y'all, stay away from those blunts, man. Hashtag papers only. Stay away from those blunts. A lot of people don't realize those blunts are tobacco leaves or they have tobacco in them. So yeah, man, y'all stay away from those blunts, man, if you can. Get those paper, get those cones, get those papers. Smoke out of your bongs, bongs or bowls. Um, Cause they're saying that that's gonna affect you a lot more if you are a tobacco smoker. You know, I'm gonna be hot boxing. I haven't hot boxed in a long time, like probably since college, to be honest. So <clears throat> I'm probably doing some coughing. I don't have the Rona, I promise. <clears throat> man, this is potent, man. Um, this is some potent stuff. I'm gonna try not to tap out, man. I'm gonna try not to have to roll the windows down. I'm gonna try to hot box this thing the whole way. But this shit is strong, I'm not gonna stunt. As far as CBD goes, this is easily the, the most potent strain I've tasted that tastes super similar to THC. And smells, I just made a, oh, you see it? Smells super similar to THC. <clears throat> tastes super similar to THC. Has that potency. Oh, I'm not a THC smoker myself, really. I do occasionally, but um, if you're a TAC smoker going to CBD, whether you're doing, you know, a tolerance break or whatever, this special special sauce might be a strain you want to try. 
This is not bad at all. I tried it yesterday, and I'm going to be honest, I wasn't a fan of the flavor. Not yesterday, like three days ago, two days ago. Or I put some in a bowl just to try it before I did the review, because I don't want to review anything that I don't like. Um, but yeah, it, it, it didn't hit right for some reason. I don't know. Maybe it was my bowl. It is a new pipe, and I am a new um, pipe smoker. It smells closer to THC, regular marijuana, than any, any type of CBD I've ever smelled, for sure. So once again, THC smokers, if you're on a tolerance break and want to still smoke something, it's going to have you feeling good. And, and uh, this special soft strain is, might be one you want to try. I haven't tried the special soft strain from another company. This is the only one that I've tried. Um, and I want to try the special sauce from some other companies, though. I will say, though, for you non-smokers like myself, I'm not a huge smoker unless it's the CBD flower. Um, this hits a lot harder than most CBD that I've had. Like Most of the CBD that I've tried has been super smooth on the throat, hasn't hit the throat or chest very hard. But this here is hitting a little different. <laughs> Like I haven't been coughing in the video, <clears throat> but you might see me coughing a little bit in this one. This this hits a little harder. And once again, as a non-smoker for real, I don't really get my flower for that reason. So that takes away a little bit for me. I want that smooth smoke. This shit like hits hard, <clears throat> a little a little harsh on the throat for me. I'm not gonna stunt. And it don't help that I'm in here hot boxing. But other than being super harsh on the throat, the taste of it isn't bad at all. Like it, it has a pretty solid taste and it's almost kind of sweet. It's not as sweet as that sour sour space candy. Damn. I'm sorry, y'all. <laughs> I told you it's been a minute since I hot box. But it's not as sweet as that sour space candy. There's some kids outside. I'm about to walk past them and I'm be smelling like straight loud. So I apologize. <laughs> I'm gonna be honest. This is probably not a strain that I'm going to continue to order. Um, cause it's a little stout for me. You know, I need that smooth feel. Um, this shit is like the closest thing to regular THC or marijuana that I've ever smoked. As far as the CBD flower goes. Any CBD smokers, go ahead and drop what you're smoking on in the comments. Any CBD users, go ahead and drop what company that you get your CBD from in the comments as well. Oh, man. It's smoky in here, y'all. It's mad smoky in here. I'm almost done. I'm trying to hurry up with this shit. I know everybody riding past is thinking I'm probably in here just blowing some super gas, but... It is what it is. I look at this shit. It's hella smoky. I want to know what the people watching this stuff, man. What do y'all like? What do y'all do? You know, what are y'all up to? Y'all, y'all content creators. Y'all, what do you do, man? I want to know. Rappers, producers, singers. If you're checking out, if you've been checking out my channel for the CBD flower, you know, um, go ahead and go browse through the channel, man. Check out some of the music. I just put an album out called, you know, uh, EP out called Too Broke to Be Lit. It just broke 2,000 plays on Spotify. It's about 4,000 plays all over. All right. The cone is all gone. I'm going to let some air out this bug real quick so I can talk to y'all. Actually review this. <laughs> the smoke is shooting out of the car like crazy. It looks like my car is definitely on fire right now. But yeah, first let's talk about the presentation. So I got the five gram variety pack and they all came in these little baggies, one gram each. They have the 4-4 CBD LLC sticker as well as the special sauce sticker. Nothing too crazy, but I talked about it in the last video. Video, excuse me, it's still smoky in here. I really do like the packaging of these. As far as how the our actual flower looked and felt, it was a little bit sticky, but not too. It wasn't as sticky as 
that sour space candy like I like it. So I'm gonna take it down a little bit from the sour space candy on the presentation, not due to the packaging, but due to the actual flower itself. I'm gonna give that a four out of five. Really good looking flower. You can see the tricones and everything, but it don't have that stickiness to it like I like. It's sticky, but not, it don't stick to the fingers. It's not super sticky like that sour space candy that they have. So next, um, let's talk about the smell of this thing. Um, I already told y'all about that smell, man. That smell is loud. Um, that's a loud, loud, loud strain right there. Um, smells like gas. Uh, before you light it, while you light it, like the smell is on point. You can't actually more on the smell. Like you can trick your CBD, your TAC smokers with this. Like you, I wouldn't do that, but you know, nobody would be able to tell the difference between this and anything else. Um, this is some loud flower. So as far as the smell goes, I'm gonna give that a five. That, that smells good. It stinks really, really good. Uh, let's go to the taste. As far as the taste of this flower, I'm gonna be honest, it hits a little harsh for me. <clears throat> like I feel it right here in my throat and I haven't felt that since the last time that I smoked like actual TAC. <clears throat> and it's, uh, it hits, it hits harsh, man. It hits hard. Like, <clears throat> I'm still getting that out of my throat um, right now. So it's a little harsh for me. Um, so I'm going to take that down a little bit for me. I, it just does. It, it hits harsh. It's not as smooth as their other strains. Um, if you're a THC smoker, though, you'll probably love this. But me, somebody who's not like a smoker, smoker like that, um, it's harshness takes some of what, something away from me. It just doesn't taste as good because it's so harsh. And you can taste a little sweetness, but not as much as I would like. So. I'm gonna give the taste a four out of five as well. Um, and next we're gonna talk about the effects. Um, sitting at 17.92 CBD, um, the effects of this product are pretty good. Um, it's not as intense as the Bubba Kush from them, from them that I tasted, um, but the effects do work pretty well. But yeah, it was pretty good. I feel good. <clears throat> I feel relaxed. My mind is relaxed. I personally felt more relaxed after the Sour Space Candy. <laughs> And I had the Sour Space Candy, I shared it with someone. Um, with this one, I had the whole one to myself. Um, so that just has to tell me that it just, for me, it didn't hit as hard on the effects. So I'm gonna have to give the effects a four out of five as well. So that's gonna be a final score of a four out of five on the presentation, five out of five on the smell, four out of five on the taste, and four out of five on the effects. Um, really solid score. This is not a knock on this flower at all. It's good just compared to their other ones that I've had. It just, it's just not as good as those, man, to me. But anyways, I hope you like this review. Once again, if you're looking to try some of the CBD flower, I have the link in the bio. If you're looking to try some other type of CBD that's not flower related, maybe like drops or gummies, I have a link to American Shaman CBD link in my um, description of this video as well. Hey, if there's any strains you would like me to try, any strains that you recommend, go ahead and drop those in the comments. If you like this video, it will help me out so much if you click the like button and the subscribe button. By doing that, you, you're telling YouTube that you like this type of content and you want to continue to see this type of content. If you don't do that, then, then YouTube won't share my videos with you anymore. And I want you to keep watching these videos and I want us to keep interacting. So like and subscribe if you like it. But anyways, it's your boy Eddie Knight. I'm out.